Studio 61, powered by Vantage TV by Frontier. All right, Tim, thank you. Uh, back now here at Studio 61, where big names in tennis are heading to the Elm City another year, beginning next weekend on the 18th, the Connecticut Open. 20 years young, serving up plenty of action. And who better to tell us about all that action? Tournament director Ann Worcester joining me, the, the queen, I don't want to say the queen of tennis <laughs> when it comes to New Haven, but you really are, and, and I've known you for years and having lived in New Haven for many years, you really are one of those uh, few people that has really pushed the ball forward with New Haven. So we have you to thank for a lot of that. And you've kept this thing going and thriving. Well, New Haven's a great host city. We love the dining, the culture, mm -hmm. the shopping. There's so much. Mm -hmm. the, the players love to come to New Haven. Sure. Um, we did an interview with Petra Kavitova last night with the media, and she went on and on about how New Haven is great restaurants, and it's the calm before the sure. storm of New York. I, I, that, that's a great way to put it, right before the U.S. Open. Let's talk about the Connecticut Open, because at 20 years, did you ever think in, in your wildest dreams that this would grow into really uh, one of the central uh, central events of New Haven, and Connecticut for that matter? I really didn't know what I was getting into 20 <laughs> years ago, and I think there is a lot of... Um, a lot of there's been a lot of surprise that the tournament has been able to attract so many top players the mm -hmm. week before the U.S. Open, mm -hmm. but the top players love to play here because it's the same surface, the same climate, mm -hmm. the same time zone, and we treat them really well, mm -hmm. and they love New Haven, sure. and so we get you know a lot of the top players and a lot of the young Americans, mm -hmm. and a lot of the younger players who are already winning tournaments. You mention a lot of the same things. But there's a lot different and there's a lot growing. So let's just mow through the list right now. And we'll start with a player that I, I think everyone's heard of, Martina Navratilova. We are celebrating 20 years. And who better to bring in but the greatest of all time, sure. Martina Navratilova. Uh -huh. So she's coming on a Monday, um, August 21st. What a way to kick she'll off the, be the a shindig. Part, she'll be a part of our Yale opening ceremony with mm -hmm. all the WTA players. And then she's going to play mixed doubles, Matt with Mats Wielander, another Grand Slam champion okay. who's a Connecticut resident. Mm -hmm. So that's our first opening night ceremony, and that's very new this year because it's the first time we brought in women's legends because, mm -hmm. as you know, we always sure. bring in men's legends. And they were at the end of the week, and you've got Michael Chang and John McEnroe coming back, and, of course, James Blake. And uh, Mark Filippoussis, so, I mean, the Australian. Al always fun to, great wa guys. to watch them have, have fun. In between, uh, there's lots of things that have uh, changed. You guys have spent a lot of uh, time and effort renovating uh, the tennis center. Yes. Uh, down, I always I call it down below, the, the media down center, everything to make the players not just comfortable, but want to come back. Yeah, thanks to the state of Connecticut, um, we have completely renovated the player center, the media center, the administrative offices, mm -hmm. um, all kinds of great physical improvements that not only are cost savings, but now the tennis center can be used year round for mm -hmm. corporate events. Which is important. For trade shows, mm -hmm. for birthdays, weddings, bar mitzvahs. Um, it's finally set up to do those things. And who better would want to have a uh, bar mitzvah at a joint that Porsche is now going to be part of as well, right? Talk about what's new this year. Our official car partner is Porsche, uh -huh. who has a, a global partnership with the with the, the Women's Tennis Association mm -hmm. worldwide. Mm -hmm. And fans are going to love. There's there's going to be fantastic car and, displays and all over ahead, the site. And give us a little tease because you're going to break news right now. Porsche is going to be uh, part of something really big there. We have a brand new social zone mm -hmm. that we're launching next week and. And Porsche will be the sponsor of it. So in and around car displays, there'll be all kinds of ways for fans to um, to enjoy their uh, Connecticut Open memories on social media. No, and everyone gets a Porsche with tickets. No, that's not right. You should you know, work, fat and work heads on that. And sure. Instagram frames <laughs> and all kinds of photo and of booth course, props. Uh, and uh, of course, lots of great food there. You mentioned the, the uh, before we did this that the uh, Connecticut Convention Center is going to be uh, doing brand new food. catering partner in the Connecticut um, Convention Center. But also the more food, food trucks. trucks than ever before, including mm -hmm. Bears Smokehouse Barbecue, love which them. all my Hartford friends love. They love and they'll travel for that. And so. live music every night. Tick and tickets are still available. Tickets so are still available we, on ctopen.org. Which we will link to our website at fox61.com. Always fun and always hoping for the best of weather you've had. The last couple of years, the weather has been pretty darn good for We've the whole thing. We've been very lucky, so, so please keep up the good work, I will Matt. do my best with that. Ann Worcester, thanks for coming thanks on. Thanks for we having appreciate me. appreciate it. We're going to take a time out right now. When we come back on the Fox 61 Morning News, we've got our pet of the week. We mentioned earlier, it's International Cat Day, so the Connecticut Humane Society bringing back 
one of their little kittens. It's a cutie. Erica is going to have her. That's all coming up next. Studio 61, powered by Vantage TV by Frontier. With better features and a better price, it's better than cable.